India has once again uh, cleared its stand as far as uh, the Israel-Palestine uh, issue is concerned and also welcomed a truce between Israel and Hamas. India's permanent representative to the United Nations, Ruchira Kamboj, uh, spoke at the UN General Assembly. India has a zero-tolerance approach to terrorism. India has always supported a negotiated two-state solution to the Israel-Palestine issue, leading to the establishment of a sovereign, independent, and viable state of Palestine, living within secure and recognized borders, side by side, in peace with Israel. Well, uh, India reaffirming uh, the stand and the long-standing relationship with the Palestinian people and its support for a negotiated two-state solution while highlighting uh, India's zero-tolerance approach to terrorism as uh, India's representative also urged the international community to make collective efforts and take steps that would uh, lead to a de-escalation of the situation while condemning acts of terrorism as well. She urged the international community to make collective efforts and uh, clearing India's stand. As far as Palestine is concerned, she said India supports a negotiated two-state solution, but at the same time made it clear that India's uh, policy as far as terrorism is concerned is zero tolerance. India's zero tolerance approach to terrorism is something that the Prime Minister also spoke about uh, when Hamas attacked Israel. Remember, a lot of uh, domestic politics happened on the issue but uh, once again at the UN uh, General Assembly, Ruchira Kamboj, India's permanent representative to the United Nations, welcoming truce between Israel and Hamas has made it clear, as far as Palestine is concerned, India supports the negotiated two-state solution. All right, with that, we head into a short break.